Hi guys, what's up? It's Marlene. Hey, I'm back. I hope you love this. You probably have seen this before, but so I'm here today to tell you about my Fear Crusher course, which will be an online go at your own pace kind of course. It will start on October 15th. Okay, so it's October 15th. If once you pre order the class, because right now it's in pre order phase until October 15th, you can still join after October 15th. The only thing is, the, the, um, the pre-order price will change and it will reset to the full price, right? So the course is $20, right? It's gonna have 10 classes. So it's one course with 10 classes. And I will be doing a, clo uh, a class once a week, all right? So once a week, you'll log on, right? And then you'll see that there's new content on the platform. The platform that I'm using is called Kajabi. Okay, um, that's the platform I'm using. I'm going to be uploading all the courses there. All the videos will be on there. Um, the assignments will be on there. The study guides will be on there. Um, so everything you need to successfully get to the course will be on there. Okay, uh, and I'm truly excited to do that because I did it the first, well, the first time I started the courses in 2020, but I was doing them in person. We were do, actually doing it online, but via Zoom. And it was like super early in the morning. It was either twice or three times a week. Okay, so if I'm in person, which is what I like about Kajabi because there's such a, um, there's, there are a lot of issues with time changes, time zones, what time is suitable for me? What time is suitable for you? And a lot of time it just doesn't work. It just doesn't work. So with Kajabi, like it really allows you to create your content, to pre-record your content, build your course, right? And then the person or whoever is purchasing the course can actually, you know, do the course whenever the time is suitable for them. So it works for you. It works for them. It works for everybody. Then maybe like once in a while, I will have a webinar just to kind of, you know, talk to the whole group or whoever can join. I can talk to them, but I really like that. And like moving forward, um, I really want to take that seriously. I, cause you know, I have an issue with consistency sometimes. I can be honest with that, but I was like, Oh my gosh, I don't know. I don't know. But now that I'm filming and I see how it looks, I'm like, I kind of like this. I kind of like this. I, I really love teaching. I like talking to people. I like motivating people. I love working with women, but the classes are unisex stuff for, and also like the classes are faith-based, right? The classes are faith-based. Um, they rely on the Bible, the script, the, you know, the Holy, the, the Bible, the Holy scriptures, but you know, if you are any other denomination, I do think you can take it. I did, ha I do have students, um, previous students who were Muslims who took classes with me. Like, you know, because I'm sure like you can find like suitable verses in the Quran or in the Torah, you know. Listen, y'all, at the end of the day, we all try to be good people, man. It works. It just, it just works. We got to, you know what I'm saying? It just works. It's just that the Bible is a book that I'm more familiar with. So it actually works. But um, then I stopped because I got really, really busy. And I was like, the, and, like the, the physicality of it, like, you know, it was too much. And I was like, I don't know, do I want to do Kajabi or not? Do I want to do Kajabi or not? And I remember like years ago, may she rest in peace, Cece. I've missed Cece so much. Um, Cece, her page on Instagram is called The Six Figure Chick. She's from Alabama. She passed away unexpectedly. She had cancer before. Cece beat the cancer and then it came back and she didn't tell us. And then one day we got on Instagram and we got the news. It was, I was so defeated. I love Cece so much because Cece didn't care. If you ever, if you used to follow the six figure chick when Cece was an old child, she would post on, on the shave room. They start roasting her. Oh, she's just recycling stuff on the internet. She's like, okay, and I'm recycling and I'm putting it together nicely. So what? Like she's like, oh, don't read the comments. I don't care about these people. I'm getting my traffic. And then every day she would like write, like she would just like manifest like, okay, I want to make a hundred thousand. So I got to have this amount of product. I'm going to sell this product for this. Da, 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 da. And then she would do like these bundles. I mean, Cece was making money. And the crazy thing is she used to work, I think as a customer service person, if I'm not mistaken. And she was making like $21,000 a year. And then like her first year, I think she made the hundred thousand. It just went, it just went, it just kept growing. And before she passed, she was making a million dollars. She had made a million dollars. And the year that she passed, she was on her way to make another million. But that time, it was going to be like even sooner. Because I think the last time it took her like a whole year to make a million. But at that time, I think she was, I think like by June, July, she already had like 700,000. No, Cece didn't play. Like, oh, I love my girl Cece, man. She ain't here. You know what I mean? And like, she's so crazy. I miss her. I miss her. I miss her so much, you know? Um, you know, but she was a motivator. Like, and I think she used to use Kajabi also because she used to put us on, like, she's the reason why I even opened a website on um, Squarespace, to be honest. 
But Kajabi is really good. Kajabi works good because you can do courses, you can do quizzes, you can do assessments. I love that. I love that. I love that so much just to make sure that because when you give people an, an assessment, it really allows you to see if they really understood what you just said, what you thought or like what they had to read. So the teacher, I mean, like just loves that so much. Right. And so I've been thinking about, I was like, you know what, Marlene, you got to take this seriously the way CC would. Right. And I would love, and I'm being really honest with you because I don't, you know, I don't think talking about money is a problem. I don't think people should hide their real intentions. I would love to build a multi-million dollar online course business. Like I really would. I don't see why not. You know what I mean? Like I'm so good at talking. I can talk for like one time I went live for like 15 hours. No, I don't, I, maybe, but I don't know. I don't think there's a person that can out talk Marlene. I don't know. But I would love, 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 love to have a multi-million dollar, you know, online, like, course stuff, like, where I'm just teaching people. Come 30, I ain't trying to be famous, y'all. Mm-mm. No. But I am trying to build a reputation of, like, consistency and being the kind of person that helps to, like, lift people up, right? No, fame I don't want. But reputation of being someone who empowers people, motivates people, encourages people, helps people to change their mindset. I, you can, oh, if you talk to Marlene, if you spend time with Marlene, if you take a course with Marlene, you're going to just change and become a whole new person and pursue what it is that God has called you to pursue. Yes, I want to be that person. I truly do. I truly do. So I'm like, I got to start somewhere. So I'm like, you know, this month, I told myself like October was the month. I really hope that I really, really, truly hope that by the end of the year, I can make $100,000 um, with the courses. I really don't. I'm, I'm putting it out there. Some people might be like, oh my gosh, that's so much money. But it really is not that much money. <laughs> it really isn't. So I'm going to have different Kajabi platforms. Right now, I'm building the Faith one because it's going to have Faith Crusher, uh, Faith Bootcamp, Fear Crusher, Faith Bootcamp, and the Mindset course. I might add more uh, personal development courses on that one because there's an option like there's a... Um, there's a tier, there's a monthly tier for Kajabi that allows you to have like three courses, three products. And then there's a, uh, another monthly tier that allows you to have like 15. So that where I'm putting the fear crusher, the fate bootcamp and the mindset one that, that Kajabi page is truly, truly going to be about like personal development. Okay. Um, truly the, the courses will always be affordable. I don't think I'll ever do something like higher than like 40 bucks or so they'll, they'll be really, really affordable so that everybody can take them. Okay. Um, I think it's pretty good. I do want you to take, I think you'll like it. I think you'll really, I think you'll love spending like 10 hours, 10 or 20 hours with me, like teaching me. I promise you. Like, oh, Marlene, where you are? Da, da, da. So if you're looking for me and you can't find me, you haven't heard from me, you can just get a cool course and then you'll have like 20 hours with me. Right. It's, it's a wonderful deal. And then at the same time you're supporting me and then I'm helping you overcome something. Cause you know, so that's good. And then I'm going to do another one for like the makeup stuff. And then I'll do another one for like sex and marriage. Um, I really want to talk about that. I want to have courses around that. I want to have a podcast around that. I want to have um, webinars around that, like marriage and sex. Like, and that pertains to people who are looking to get married, people who are married, getting bored, people who are trying to get, people who might be considering getting divorced, people who want to be divorced, like all this kind of stuff, like whatever. But it's really going to be like sex and marriage kind of topics, right? So that'll be a different, so I don't, so it's not like all mixed up like that, but it's going to take me time to build all that. But hopefully I should be done building all this stuff. And then daily, I'll just record a video, like a course for each one. But that's really my vision. Like, I really, really want to take like this online teaching stuff really seriously. I think it's a beautiful thing. I think it's awesome if you have some knowledge, if you have great knowledge, if you have great information that you can pass to people and it can really help the people. I do think you should monetize your, I, you should monetize your intelligence. Like, you should monetize your your knowledge. You should. You know, stop seeking like bunch of followers. No, no, no. Seek people that you can help. You know what I mean? Seek people that you can help and seek people who are looking for the help, right? Find a price that works for you, that works for them so that everybody is it's a mutually beneficial situation. Like I, I, I look for synergies. Like, yes, I do. I don't like people who just take, take, take and don't know how to give. It bothers me. You know what I mean? And that might be a reason also why I don't respond to some people's DMs. Cause I'm like, you, you always want to take, 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 but when do you ever offer something? Right. So when I encounter people who never, I'm not going to say anything. Cause I want to, I don't, I don't care to go back and forth with people, but 
you know, to me, it's imperative. Like, if you know how to take, you should also know how to give. Generosity is a big thing for me. You know what I'm saying? It's a big, big thing for me. And, I, and I'm really, I gravitate towards people who are very, very generous. When I feel that you're stingy, you and I is just not going to work. We're not going to click. You know what I'm saying? But I'll be fake, though. You know, you got to be fake out here in the street. So I'll entertain you a little bit, but not as much. Because I, I, I don't like fake people. I don't like fake energy. Um, makes sense. So Fear Crusher will be coming out October 15th. So please pre-order, okay? The link probably won't be up today because I'm still, hopefully tomorrow the website will be live. Now it's not, the website won't be as fancy because that's a lot of decoration. I'll get someone to do that later, but the courses will be live um, on October 15th. So the first course will be live October 15th. I'm excited about that. I am, I am. Um, excited to build something new. You, got, you know, and that's the thing. When you're an entrepreneur, you got to try many things. You have you got to have multiple things, right? It's not just one thing. So that's exciting to me. And I look forward to also doing the one for the marriage one because that's a big one for me also. So, yeah, guys. So Fear Crusher course is coming. It'll be October 15th. Um, it's going to be Fear Crusher. It's going to be um, the Mindset course. And it's also going to be Fate Boot Camp. So all three will be going live all at once, okay? Um, and you can get all three if you want at the pre-order price. They'll all be 20 bucks. So you can get all three if you want to. You can just get one, whatever. But if you pre-order any class, like if you pre-order any course by the 15th, you can get them at the rate of 20 bucks, which is good. So it's 10 classes per course for $20, right? And you will have like worksheets, worksheets. you will have assessments, you will have... um. Homeworks, hopefully you do them. They're not going to be graded, but it would be great if you actually took the time to do them so that way it can really help you to like find out where all these issues are coming from. All right. So thank you so much. I am excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Tomorrow I'll do another video also reminding you. Yes, honey, you have to spam the people. Make sure the message gets through. And I'm going to say another thing also, right? If you do have a business, right? Because I do plan on having like business classes also. Because I, I had a business course. I had a branding course. So I have to like film that. Because once again, it's a lot easier if it's pre-recorded. So I will be focusing on that. I think the business course is maybe more so in November. Right now I'm going to focus on like the personal development courses. But in November I can start. That way I'm done recording this and then I can start recording that. But I do want to say something, right? If you are an entrepreneur, if you're working for yourself, if you are considering working for yourself, right? If you have any platform, okay? Do not feel bad about spamming people. Like, do not feel bad about being in people's faces, right? Like, a lot of us, a lot of my followers are black, you know what I'm saying? So we black, we black in America, right? And the thing that's really prevalent in black America is hip-hop, right? And a lot of hip-hop artists, before they got to be really famous, right, they were in people's faces, like, doing cyphers everywhere, right? Doing rap battles everywhere, having mixtapes and selling them to everywhere. Like, I love Master P. I love the story of Master P. Master P was out here making him say, oh. Oh, na, 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 na. If you bought it, bought it. If you bought it, bought it. I represent. Okay. Make him say, uh. Okay, like Master P. Master P from New Orleans. Right? Master P is a hustler for real. But it's like this man did not, he was not born into wealth. Like they were all in a, in a, like a house. You know, the granddad and the grandma, his dad and all, and then the grandkids, which is him, Corey and all his brothers, whatever, you know, Master P drove all the way from New Orleans, all the way to Richmond, California. Like, it's crazy. Like what he had to go through to build No Limit, right? Um, make, the, you know, make them say, huh, you know, but a lot, that's what hip hop is. It's the grind like that. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like if you're a fan of hip hop, if you're a student of hip hop, like you should know, like, I gotta be in people's faces. Like that's what even, even Nikki, like before Nikki was famous, like she was everywhere pushing her mixtapes on people. Like who is this chick? Like what the heck? Now look where she's like, oh my gosh, I remember when she was at the ball. Okay. But that's what it takes, like hip hop. That's the that's the mentality about hip hop that I love. Like back in the day too, when like when Fat when Def Jam was really big, right? Russell came out with with Fat Farm, and he was trying to get all the artists that were signed to to Def Jam to promote his clothing line, right? And Damon Dash was like, Nah, we wearing Rockaway, ah, with the diamonds in the air, ah, okay. You know what I'm saying? 
But it's like, that, and that's and for as much as like Damon might be cocky sometimes, but Damon is like, Damon Dash is real hip hop. Like, I love him so much. I really do. Listen, nobody's perfect, right? Nobody's perfect. Nobody's perfect. You keep looking for the perfect somebody, you're going to get disappointed. But it's like, that's what hip hop is. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's the ciphers, it's the battles. Like, even Biggie Smalls, like, Biggie used to battle all kinds of people. You know what I mean? It's on site. Like, people put a beat, they give you a microphone. I remember I used to also watch, like, ciphers with, like, BT. When BT was black, black, all black, for black people, like, for real, for real. Like, they would play, like, sometimes it would be, like, really late at night. But you remember we also had, like, Tigger in the Basement. That was that, that was cool. We had Tigger in the Basement. But, like, they would have, like, like um shows where they would play, like, these, like, people recording, like, these 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 battles. Like, sometimes it was, like, in a basement somewhere. It'd be in a staircase somewhere. I'd be like, child, what is this, right? You have, like, Wu-Tang. It was the entire block. Wu Tang is an, like yo, it's like twenty five hundred thousand of them. Like what the heck? But it's the Wu. <laughs> like really? No, like but that's what Wu Tang was, right? You know what I'm saying? My favorite though was Ghostface Killer. Oh, Ghostface! I thought Ghostface was so fine. Ghostface. Baby, they call me a mysterious thing. Oh. Ghostface. I remember one time I was like 16. It was the summer when I was 16 years old. I went to New York and I think I was like somewhere in Soho and Ghostface Killer passed by in like a Ford Explorer window down and he was wearing the, like the, um, oh, the do-rag thing, right? I was like, when he, I was like, oh my gosh, because his eyes are so iconic. I was like, oh my gosh, that's Ghostface Killer! Oh, <laughs> Ghostface, <laughs> It's the woo! So, you know, but that, that, like, that's really what it is, though. You know what I'm saying? So, it's like, do not be embarrassed. Like, they're like, oh, my gosh. I'm like, I don't know if I, if it's too much. I don't know if it's too little. Girl, is it ain't enough? You got to be in people's faces. Like, everywhere you go, there's a McDonald's commercial. Like, everywhere you go, there's a Popeye's commercial, right? Like, these big companies who are making all kinds of money do not stop promoting. Like, they're all over the place. They're on YouTube. They're on Instagram. They're on Snapchat. They're in those stories, right? They're always in people's faces, right? So, be free from that kind of self-awareness. Like, oh, maybe I'm promoting too much. I don't know. Maybe I don't want to see too much. Girl, girl, back. They have not seen you enough. This is hip hop. We black people, we make things happen out of nothing, right? And the only way you can make something happen is by being in people's faces. Like, yes, I have a course. It's coming on October 15th. You want to take it. You want to pre-order. You want to save. It's only $20. I'm only asking for one Andrew Jackson. Y'all can't give me one white man real quick. You know what I'm trying to say? Just one dead president. That's all she asking for. You see what I'm saying? I even asking for Benjamin Franklin. I said, just give me Andrew Jackson. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know what I'm saying? So it's like, don't be shy. I'm telling you, a closed mouth don't eat. You know what I mean? Don't be shy. Be in people's faces. Let people know what you want. Let people know what you need. Rihanna does. Beyonce does. All these rich people keep wanting to get richer. So why are you afraid to be loud about what you're working on and what you're trying to do? Don't let anybody shame you into silence. Yes, girl. And if you're a female, you know, one thing that we have, y'all, please sign for my course. Pre-order the course. I want you to open up your phone. Put it in your phone. I have to, I have to pre-order Marlene's courses. We're not playing out yet. Yo, we're not playing like, oh my gosh, like this is the last, we got three months left in this year. We are not playing. We're just not. Come on now. Every day you wake up, you see all kinds of tests. Oh, I just made a million dollars. I just, oh girl. It's going to be you and I. You and I like a lullaby. Ex-girlfriend, how you been? Ah! <laughs> That was Method Man and D'Angelo. What you know about that? Ex-girlfriend, how you been? <laughs> I see you still trying to creep with other ladies' men. <laughs> but anyways, okay. Don't be shy, girl. Don't be shy. And, and one advantage that you have as a woman, we know how to get glammed up. We know how to get dolled up. We know how to be pretty. We know how to be fancy. Like, use that to your advantage. Like, this top, you might not believe this, right? Let me tell you something, right? Because the glam is real, right? The finessing is real. 
right? But this top right here, this is something I got like for like 20, like it was $10 at the mall. Oh, it's kind of cute. Cause I'm doing the B palette. Here's the B palette. Mm -hmm. B palette is coming out. The B palette also will be on sale October 15th. Don't be shy. And then I even have a mirror. That's going to be on sale also. Shout out to Oshun coming through with the peacock. Okay, okay. I have a mirror going on sale. I have lipsticks going on sale. I have the lemonade palette going on pre-order. Girl, let the people know what you're selling. So this is the B palette with my mama. This is my mom. This is the Louisiana. How do you say Beyonce without saying Beyonce? You put a bunch of B's on the palette. What up, B? What up, what up, what up, Queen B? Eh, throw your diamonds in the air. Okay, so don't be shy about it. Do not be shy. Talk about what you got. Talk about what you've been working on. Talk about what you're selling. Do not be shy. I am telling you, people do not get to billionaire status by being shy. People don't get opportunities by being shy. Speak up. I put some delays on my background over here. It looks so pretty. Like, it looks so nice and regal. But these are nothing more than delays. A lot of people have delays in the house. And then the yellow right there, that's just some fabric, right? But it works. It's cute. It works. It's fine. It's, no, it's not as high budget, right? But we're going to get there. We're going to get there. But it's like be bold, be proud, be confident, rep your set. Okay? Rep your set, girl. Rep your set. Rep your set. What's your set? Okay. Rep your set. Rep your set. Rep, rep, rep. Is you repping? Is you repping? Rep your set. Okay? This is what I'm selling right here, y'all. The double L. The double L. I'm repping my set. What's your set? Double L. Ain't last. What's up? What's happening? What's happening? Eh, eh, eh. Oh, 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 oh. Who that be? Who that, baby? Who that? Who that? Who that? Who that? The 504. Okay? So, rep your set. Rep your set, rep your palette, okay? B palette coming out, the mirrors coming out, choruses are coming out. I'ma do what Rihanna does, okay? Okay, I'ma have multiple businesses, girl. I'ma have multiple, multiple streams of income, baby. Yes, hunty, yes, multiple streams of income, yes, okay? And don't be shy about it. The, even the weaves is coming back. I'm bringing back the hair. I'm bringing back the, the bundles. I'm bringing back the, the closures. I'll bring back the, I'm going to bring the HD frontals. I will also have some wigs also. So we're bringing everything back, ladies. This season, this season, I will not have any shame whatsoever. So yes, okay. Courses is coming out October 15th. Pre-order price is $20.00. Two zero one. Andrew Jackson, you got it. I know you got it because the good Lord told me you got it. Okay, and the Lord told me there's over 50 people out here who gonna watch this video. I'm like, you know what? She's so crazy. Let me see what this is all about. Then you're gonna take the course, you're gonna be boom, blown away. Like, ah, terrible shit. I can't believe this. Oh, she good. I'm real good. Maybe I'm good. Suavemente, besame. Te quiero te tener daña. Posan en suavemente, bame, bamente. Suave, besame. Suavemente. Okay, I am good like that. Suavemente, besame. That was my jam. Te quiero te tener daña. Besame, besame. Suave, besame. Suave. Okay, so October 15th, the course is coming out. The link will be in the description box below. I'll create a bunch of videos. Until October 5th, 14th, I will see you in the course October 15th. I might even do a live that day on the Kajabi. They'll be like, what's up? What's up? Who's taking the course? October 15th, the pre-order price is $20. Okay, okay. And you can get three courses, right? For 20, so it'll be like 60. Okay, okay. So I'm expecting you to do this. I mean, well, I guess swipe or I guess like type the digits. I guess like whatever you want to say. But, you know, I'm excited, you guys. I'm excited. So thank you so much. Let's have an amazing year. Let's reach our sales goals. Let's have fun. Let's look good. Let's lose some weight. Get back in the gym. Get some strength. Ah, ah, ah. Look right there. Ah, where are we work? I'll be working with some, y'all. I'll be working with some. You ain't worried about this. You don't know about this, right, you? <laughs> so I love y'all, and I will see you tomorrow for another video. Also, do not forget to check out my Patreon. I'm going to have some great juicy topics there tonight. We got Tiwa Savage with the whatever tape is out there. We have Nicki Minaj hosting the reunion for Real Housewives of Potomac. Girl, 
We want to talk about men a little bit, love, dating, relationships. It's going to be good. It's going to be juicy. It's going to be mesmerizing. It's going to be worth that $3, okay? One, five, or 10. But whatever it is, it's going to be worth it. So head over to the Patreon. It is called I Care About Black Issues. We black out here, y'all. We blackity black. And we proud, okay? So head over to the Patreon. Support the kid. Support the kid. The kid's going to be really happy. You know what I mean? Please, 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 please. You know, we went out here, man. We went out here. And you know, hopefully one day we'll actually get to meet. I think do like a little conference, like convention. We kind of cute. But we need dineros, okay? All right. I put on my jewelry just to go to the bodega. But I put on my jewelry just to come and holla at you and to tell you, baby, the course is coming out October 15th. The prize is $20. Pre-order course starts on the 15th. I won't be there, but I'll be there. You know what I mean? I won't be there physically, but I'll be there in the spirit, okay? And once a week, I'll drop a new course, okay? I put on my jewelry just to go to the bodega. I put on my jewelry just to come out here and holla and tell you, baby, she needs a dollar, okay? Hey, baby, hey, baby, hey, baby, hey, baby. Love y'all. See y'all tomorrow. I don't talk too much. But on Patreon, there are more videos, so you better run over there. You better run over there. You better run. You better run. You better run. Ah! Show me how you running, girl. Hey! I like the way you do that right there, right there. Yo, that chicken was cute, though. Chicken was really cute. I like the remix with Trina. It was really cute. But I need you to run over there. Like, run over there. Panda replay, run over there. You run, run, okay? So run over to Patreon. Let's talk over there. Let's talk. Because T was having just too much. Like, girl, girl, all this information. Like, I woke up at 6 o'clock in the morning to that. Sis, what is we doing? Patreon, y'all. That's for the real Jews and the real tea gonna be at. Ah, we gonna be talking out there. All right, bye, you guys. I gotta go. I'm tired. I need some water. I'm exhausted. Bisous. Bye. <laughs> I'm so crazy. I'm so crazy. I think I love you. I think I love you. I think I love you. What's that? I think I love you. Oh, I think I love you, daddy. I think I love you, daddy. I, I love you. Hey, what's your name, girl? My name is Marley. Could y'all be Lena? I be that pretty girl. I be that black girl with the ponytail and the nice legs. What's going on, you? You got some cash, daddy? You all make it rain, daddy? I ain't dropping like a I be a nice black kid. I want a first round rose one. Looking at the moon like a star. It be like, girl, so pretty. Shopping every day at the sex fish. They be like, that girl's so pretty. Every day shopping at sex fish. That's the one, that's the two, that's the three, that's the four, that's the fifth. I mean, mm -mm, not fifth harmony. The fifth, 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 fifth. Call it sex, sex, sex. Car, car, car with the stack, stack, stack. What if I became a rapper, y'all? What if I became a rapper? What do you think? I can rap, though. If Cardi can do it, I can do it, too. I be the rapper, girl. I be making night twerk, because I be that girl. They call me Chocolate Lollipop. Why Chocolate Lollipop? Because I be... What you say? What you say? What you say? Where my pretty girl's at? Where my pretty girl's at? Cause I just want to come through I just uh, 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 I just want to come through mm -hmm. What's good daddy? What's good? What's happening? What's good? That girl wants to get some cash She wants to get the stash Drop it like it's hot Drop it like it's hot Until you make it rain I ain't dropping nothing I ain't dropping nothing Until you make it rain Until you make it rain Why don't you make it rain? Out of here. Deuces.